In this video, we'll give you three top tips how to make pure black background in your portrait studio. Okay, so number one tip is to have a dark, preferably black, but it can be also a medium gray or dark gray background. In our uh, case, we have a, a wall that is painted just like black, uh, so pure black paint on the wall. Uh, but if you have a medium gray or dark gray or even like a, uh, a paper background, that works su you know, super well as well. Uh, pure black is preferred, but you know, it's not necessary. So this is tip number one. Tip, tip number two is to have the model further away from the background so that you don't, so the light doesn't hit you know, the, the background that much. So in our case, this is probably six feet away from the background and uh, Sasha will be sitting right here. So this is tip number two. Tip number three is to have your main light close enough to the subject so that light fall off, so that how fast the light goes down uh, is, is going fast enough so that there's no light hitting the wall. So basically all the light just is focused on the model and there's really no light that's hitting the, the background to make it pure black. If you move the light further away from your model, the light fall off will be much uh, longer, much will reach much further, and this way you're gonna have some light hitting the background which will not make the background pure black. So, um, Sasha, I think now it's time for you to sit on our beautiful stool here and then we'll take some portraits. Uh, before we take the, uh, the actual portrait, I just want to quickly uh, discuss how we, what kind of lights we have. So our main light is the Westcott seven inch uh, umbrella with the front diffuser. So this is the, the light here. And for both lights, we're using actually Profoto D1s today, but you can use any strobes, it doesn't really matter. And then we have, uh, for the rim light, we have a second light here. This is a, a big strip. This is the uh, one by six uh, Profoto strip box. And this just gives some highlights on the, on the right side, or camera right side uh, for on Sasha. Okay, so now let's go to our camera here. We're using, again, the Canon 5D Mark IV. For this portrait, we're using the 70 to 200 lens. And we're using the Profoto um, Air Remote for Canon. And um, let's start shooting. So let's, let me see how it looks. And uh, here, here we are, let me just play it. Uh, play button. And here is the portrait. You can see it's, it's really pure black. I'm gonna take a couple more photos. Okay, so today we're using ISO 100, shutter speed 1 to 100 of a, of a second, and f-stop f4 uh, to have, you know, just some depth of field, but not too crazy, especially with the long lens, um, will be a pretty shallow depth of field of f4, uh, but this will be, you know, nice, you know, for the portraits that we, we're shooting today. Okay, so these were the three top tips, how to make a pure black background in your studio of photography. If you have any comments or ideas how to make uh, the black background even better, definitely leave a comment below. And please give it a thumbs up if you find the video useful and subscribe to support any future videos. Thank you so much and we'll see you soon.